now i'm going to explain your now date functions in oracle so there are like months underscore between it finds the number of months between date 1 and date 2 the result can be positive or negative if date 1 is later than date 2 the result is positive if date 1 is earlier than date 2 the result is negative so it has of two arguments one is date 1 another one is date 2 okay and add months it adds a calendar month to the date next day gives you the next day of the date specified and last day gives you the last day of the month round specifies uh, round the date and truncates truncates the date let me show you some examples okay months between let's take this example so so many months are there between these two uh, dates so to know that what we use select months between 0 1 September 95 comma 11 Jan 94 from so how do you remove this one from dear So yes is not there. I'm typing type of mistake. So there are 19 months between 95 and 94. Okay. The basic syntax of months between is months underscore between date one comma day 2 ok so if date 1 is later than day 2 the result is positive otherwise negative, the result is negative now let's see adds underscore month so that add underscore months 31st January ninety six from Duel. So what we are getting we added one month to January so we are getting preferring okay for a 96 so it's leap year so you are getting 99 so basic syntax of add months is add underscore months date comma n so n is a number of months and date is a current date and the value of one n must be integer or can be negative so you can add or you can subtract a month from date so now i am using minus one so so january so it should give december 95 that's it 31st december 95 i'm getting like the same way next date so what is the when you, to know the next day of the date specified so i want to know the friday next friday date of the next friday so it's you can use like 
you can give two arguments first argument is date second argument is day so you will get 8 September 95 so last day of the month using you can find out using last underscore day now round and truncate functions with the date suppose assume that today's date is 25th July 2003 so when you use round function so what it will give because 25 is close to next month so it get 1st August so round 6 date year so you are using 25th is false after 6 for example in June is a 6th month July is the 7th month so what you will get you will get next year first day of next year so for 0 for 1 January 0 2004 and month so month is truncate of month so it is 6th it is 7th month so when you do truncation so it will give 0 1 July 2003 and the year so it will give 0 1 January 2003 why 0 1 January 2003 because it is using truncate it is not using round okay